Anne, as one of the people who was down on this site at the very, very beginning, what are your feelings today? Uh, I think excitement because everybody said it would never reopen and when I first started I wasn't looking, I'm not a, sw a swimmer so I wasn't looking to open a swimming pool, uh, it was the historic side of it that Roger as you might, Roger and Janice and myself um, were just keen to save the place because the council were about to sell it. You know, there were offers, um, and we put in an offer, but they didn't accept ours because we obviously didn't have any background of management. And, um, and it's been a very slow, long process, and I've just had to keep saying to people, <coughs> we don't give up, you know, we just keep on going. There'll be hiccups, and there have been many, and there still are hiccups. We obviously not the, haven't got the pontoon, we haven't got the water source heat pump, um, but we will get everything there next year. <laughs> Looking around you now, all those years later, many millions of pounds later, um, what are your feelings? Has it turned out like you were hoping? It's a fantastic team of people that have got it this far. I mean, from Paul, the chairman, um, and Ina, who's loyally stayed with it um, she, i'm sure she wanted to walk away um, and it's the, the say the team of people now are much younger um, largely female i have to say um, and they've done a fantastic job yeah. I, I just never imagined i would be sitting here on a sunny day <laughs> we can't tempt you into the water today Sorry. We can't tempt you into the water no, today. No, not. Um, I her a I, no, my <laughs> swimming days are, have passed, particularly cold water swimming. <laughs> I might be tempted next year, maybe. <laughs>